Hey guys, here today are a couple of products from Monument. Uh, first of all, we have this blowtorch. We're also going to look at why we're using it. These we mats, the proper name for these. Found one. Yes, I knew it was something like that. The O mats. They have two different sizes here. We have a big one, there's a small one inside the sweat box, best place for it. A small one. Now, the torch itself, I found it. Sorry about that. I found very, very handy. Uh, ignites. First time almost every time. Even when it's sitting outside the damp areas, cold areas, still no problem. Goes on, locks on, no problem. Just your flame. Gives you a good steady flame, no problem at all. Now, that works brilliantly. Let's show you some of these old mats. Now, these old mats will actually go on, and if you need to, will actually wrap around the pipe. Like that. So whenever we're soldering, which I'm not a plumber again, so please excuse my skills. We've got a little bit of plasterboard here, just to show you. Because you know yourself, plasterboard burns quite easily and marks very easily. This here will help protect it. Leave it a flux on, push it on, push it in. This is this old pipe. It's not I, I haven't treated it right, I know I haven't. Get your blowtorch on it, and you're ready for your solder. Heat it all up nicely. I'll solder away. Now, to yourself, I'm doing this here, I'm quite close to it. I say I'm not a plumber, so if I'm doing it wrong, please don't shout at me in the comments. And while I'm doing it, nothing behind here is getting damaged. I'd even go closer. I'll lift the password up a bit. Because the old mat's protecting it. And this is where the old mat's especially when you're going against a wall, a skirting board, uh, customers' brand new boards, which does happen. And they've sold it away. And the plaster board has no damage to it. And to show one even closer, there's a bit of furniture board. Which is one which does not like heat. We'll use a small mat this time. Put that back inside my sweat box, which we use quite nicely by the way to hold the pipe. Not money in a sweat box, good tool. Showed that in a previous video. And we'll do the same thing again. Put that on there, try not to touch the red hot pipe. Which is good for the sweat box here, you don't have to touch the pipe. And again we'll see, every time. And we'll just solder away. We'll just put the lock on. See if holding it. I see yourself. I mean, to go right against the furniture board with no problem. Because furniture board, absolutely no marks in that whatsoever. But furniture board, as we all know, is no friend of heat. And it will burn very, very quickly without a mat in place. So to go along with your blowtorch, definitely. The old mats, great way of investment. That's a Dewey Monument blowtorch. It's a 3450G, don't know if that makes a difference. I'm using yellow gas, which is your map gas. Again, everyone's got their own preference to what they use. It fits two or three different types. If it's propane, if it's butane, no problem at all. Standard gas bottle. Definitely worthwhile investment. 